Hi, I'm Maria Kana, president of the Dartmouth Friends of the Elderly. Uh, it's a pleasure to be here to update some of the things that's been going on with us and hopefully better days are ahead of us. The Dartmouth Friends of the Elderly, it's an organization, it's a 501c, a nonprofit. Uh, started almost 40 years ago at the same time that the Dartmouth Council on Aging did. Uh, the purpose, the goals and the objectives was to help the Council on Aging with infrastructure, uh, programs, and education to the elders in the community. It's been many projects through the years. It's about five extensions in this building which the friends raised most of the money to do that. Uh, we did a wellness center, garages, vans, programs, and anything that facilitates seniors to come in and participate in the programs. So through the years, we have raised millions of dollars through fundraising. Uh, the people in Dartmouth are perhaps the most generous uh, citizens that I can think of. And they think a lot about their seniors in this community. So when we do fundraising for certain projects, they are always there to help us out. Because of the problems that exist right now, all our fundraising for the year is pretty much canceled. Uh, all of the thrift sewers are closed. Uh, so financially, uh, we have lost a lot of revenue, but what's most important here is that our population in Dartmouth, especially our seniors who are a very vulnerable population, will be okay. We'll survive all this, and uh, we'll come back as strong as we were before. Uh, we will be doing a mailing, informing the seniors the reasons why we canceled some of the uh, uh, fundraiser, especially some of our supporters year in and year out. They're always there for us. Um, yes, uh, we will um, continue to be in touch with the community and anyone who wishes to donate because we did have a lot of projects in the works. I had the pleasure of making a lot of phone calls as a volunteer uh, during this period of, of a lot, a lot of uh, heartaches. Uh, so continue to do what you're doing. Uh, by making those phone calls, uh, I was very proud of the seniors in this community. They abide by the regulations. Um, they were pretty much set in everything that they needed for being homebound for so long. Uh, and I'm sure they'll continue to do whatever needs to be done. If they need any help of any kind, we're here. We're here to help them. Only they have to do is call the Council on Aging or they can call me directly. Uh, we're still here, we're not going anywhere. Their needs may be different from prior, but we're still here to help them any way we can.